Hey y'all, it is a girl Tiggy, and I'm back again with another video. This is part three. I literally have recorded this now for the third time. I had so many technical difficulties, so I'm sorry y'all. But <laughs> let's go ahead and finish up the Samsung theme. So what you're gonna do here, if you go into Theme Galaxy, and you go back into Advanced and you scroll down, this area down here, you're not going to have to make a lot of changes. I promise you. Literally, I checked everything. And I'm sorry, I did show you guys in the first video. But the only thing that I had to change was in-call UI. So anything that's green is things that I have not modified. The darker blue is things that I've modified. Because your incoming call is for you to answer is green and your decline is red. I didn't want them to be like that. So I did change the color for that and the arrows as well. So those are the only things that I modified in this area of everything. You guys are more than welcome to go through and see if there's anything you want to change. But by hitting that inherit button, which we did in the very beginning, it made everything a lot easier and a lot smoother to do. So that is why I wanted you guys to do that part first. And I didn't go into all of this until later. Um, so there's not going to be... As you see, everything is green. I promise you guys, there's you know, there's not much you have to change either. The only thing I literally had to change was the in-call UI, and that's just because I wanted my accept and decline buttons to not be green and red. I wanted them to be specific. So what I did after that, when you're done and you checked everything, you're gonna go all the way back to this part and you're gonna hit next and you keep hitting next we get to this area just name your theme you already have set up everything else as far as your wallpaper your dial pad and things like that so you do not have to do anything you're gonna hit build and it's gonna compile the theme once it's compiled the theme it'll ask you to install it into samsung theme um, store you're gonna install once you install you're gonna go and apply it and hit trial once you hit trial you have to go into your settings and please keep in mind that every time your phone powers off you will have to go and shut everything off again if you're like me my phone doesn't really go off honey it might go on silent or mute but it don't go off okay so I don't really have to worry about that but you have to turn on developer options if you don't know how it's about phone and then you're going to go to software information and you're going to hit on build number um, and it'll tell you how many times you have left. I believe altogether it's seven. You're going to keep tapping on that and then it'll tell you that developer options have been turned on. You're going to go into running services and mine won't show because again, I've already turned that off. You're going to look for something that says themes and it'll have like a little icon like this one that says software update. It'll have a little icon like that next to it and you're going to hit on it and you're basically going to force stop it. When you're done that, you're going to go into your apps and you're going to look for the Samsung theme store, um, which is right there. And as you can see, my stuff is grayed out because I've already forced, um, stopped everything. You're going to go into storage and you're going to clear the cache as well. And that's pretty much it, y'all. There is not much that you actually have to do um, to get that to knock off. When you're done that, what I like to do is, because I was using a Samsung theme, um, you can switch back and forth and it will never delete your total launcher stuff, okay? So you don't have to worry about resetting things up. You can switch between the two whenever you'd like. Um, I go into total launcher and it says home screen and I just click on my total launcher and then it'll switch it to this which I've already set up some of this um, so that's why it looks like this and this is actually a KWGT widget that I made for music I did take the music um, icon that was part of this theme and add it to here as um, a static image so it does not move um, so I do love that um, I'm playing around with that a little bit more because uh, Ellie, I believe it was, she did ask if I could make a video on that and I'm not too familiar with it. So before I actually put a video out for you guys, I just want to make sure it has the best information for you. Um, but yeah, everything has changed. Even my battery is really cute. It's pink. Um, so there is things that, that have changed. Um, shout out to my Sunday. Thank you for following me. I appreciate it. Uh, but this is um, what it looks like so far. This is a B-Weather um, 
that Evie doll because this at this theme is by Evie doll. Um, she did create a bee weather to go alongside of that, um, and that is what you're seeing here with my weather and things like that. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or comments, please let me know. Um, everything is themed. Um, my lock screen which I didn't change much here so um, and then as you guys can see my notifications my settings my keyboard uh, my phone has also changed so everything has changed I'm not gonna open my messages because that is a little private but that also has changed as well but I hope you guys have a blessed day I hope you enjoyed this video and drop a comment Make sure if you haven't subscribed and make sure to definitely hit the bell to receive post notifications so you guys know. Um, don't forget to follow me on Instagram if you haven't. Again, that's at Style Squad and that is Styles with a Z um, so that you guys can join the Google Photo Shared album that I created so that, you know, whenever I find cute wallpapers, I just post them up there and as well as get the link to join the Telegram group for Android folk uh which this is telegram here if you guys haven't seen it um and here is the group here um so you guys can join and come join the fun and just laugh as you can see we're always cracking jokes and we send a lot of gifts um so you guys are more than welcome to come on and join us and if you need help with anything feel free to ask everyone in that group is absolutely lovely and they're so willing to help and if they don't know i will chime in and definitely help with whatever i can as well but i hope you guys have a blessed day and Enjoy.